life before surgery meant going to the opticians every 12 months, having my eyes tested, usually needing new glasses, and then you'd have to update the um, sunglasses and your spare pair as well. So, all very expensive. Um, so, when I had cataracts, I knew I had to have them seen to, I knew what I wanted done. I wanted them removed and I wanted to be able not to have to wear glasses. And uh, this operation that I've had done is, well, it's just wonderful. I had my treatment carried out at Parkside at Frimley Park Hospital. Um, Mr. Govan had been recommended to me. After I'd been to see my doctor and he'd confirmed that my cataracts definitely needed um, seeing to, um, I got referred to Mr. Govan and uh, came to see him here at uh, the Parkside Suite. The care in Parkside is uh, faultless, absolutely. Everybody is so helpful and kind and reassuring. And when I was in theatre, the nurses in theatre, they were exceptional. <laughs> um, because having your eyes operated on is uh, a bit nerve-wracking, uh, but um, the nurses in theatre were really wonderful. And of course, Mr. Govan's there to reassure you all the time, so um, no complaints. Oh, well, the operations help me because I no longer need any glasses, not for reading, not for seeing the television, not for anything. I can now pursue my hobby. I, I like hand sewing and hand sewing, and um, I can thread a needle, uh, which I haven't been able to do without um, uh, magnifying glass, and the same with instructions on cans uh, without a magnifying glass. Even with my glasses, I couldn't read it. So, colours as well. I didn't realise, in actual fact, the difference uh, it would make to colours, but it does. So, and as I say, my care, exceptional. I would definitely recommend them to have the treatment, but everybody must make up their own minds. Once the procedure has been explained to them, as it was to me, and uh, what would happen and how it would happen, um, there was no question about me not going ahead. Um, but everybody has to make their own minds up. But I'd certainly recommend Mr. Gavin and Parkside. <laughs>